What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy Spanko, and I'm actually here with Mert today as what well. Say, um, and uh, first place Toronto Regionals, the boy Josh. He came, yo, congratulations, yeah. first Thanks, of all. Appreciate that. Um, so let's let's show off the play mat. Look at the this. Xbox. Awesome. Great um, play mat. Looks gorgeous. So first thing I want to say is congratulations, of course. Uh, and second thing I want to say is what deck were you playing? How did you feel today? Obviously, you did well. Um, but I'm gonna let you take over. Yeah, so I played Branded Despia and I feel that this is a really good pick for this event specifically because Branded thrives when people are uh, disrespected. There weren't really a lot of people playing Branded here, nor do I think they were prepared for it. Um, before I go into it, uh, I'd like to shout out a few people, uh, specifically uh, everyone who helped me out. Uh, I thought you were going to say Cherry. Cherry, 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 you know, uh, <laughs> for all the moral support, Asad for helping me uh, refine the deck, uh, Kareem for uh, <laughs> almost uh, knocking me out round one, but uh, all, all good, all good. So uh, it's pretty standard, uh, but there is a little bit of spice. Wait, so how many cards are you playing? Uh, 41 cards, 41 cards. So we got uh, three Albaz. You specifically need to play three. They come up frequently, specifically in the Kashtira matchup. Um, you're running two. You risk um, getting them all banished. I remember, I think specifically in my round four opponents, um, when they went and banished three off the top of my deck. Do you have, do you have notes? Oh, yeah, I have oh, notes. Oh, 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 <laughs> yeah, they specifically banished two out of that. So I would have been done if I just uh, if I just had those three. Um, I, you know what, like, we could we could specifically go over. Yeah, what were your matchups? Yeah, so uh, so I <laughs> I played Cream uh, round one, Branded Mirror, uh, we did 2-1, two, two, and then I played Cash, I won the dice roll, went 2-0, oh, and then after that I went Sprite Runic for higher, I think I went 2-0 oh for that, then I did Cash again, um, that was a tricky one, I had to play through Ibley, I had, um, ended up winning that one, um, and Bell, and then we played Drytron against David Hartford, uh, Good, good guy, yeah. 15, maybe. Yeah, top 16. Yeah, yeah you, you guys are gonna see that profile um, too. Then we did Math Mech, uh, 2 0 him. And then we did, I think, Cash again. I think Cash was, um, I don't have notes there, but I feel like that was 2 1. And then I had, um, it was Sprite Live Twin. And I think I did. Yeah, I, I can't remember how that one. I can't remember how that one. Yeah, and then the, yeah. Is yeah, and then the last yeah. one, uh, it was some um, Sprite. Um, Try Okay. Anyways, so on to the rest. We did. We have obviously three Aluber. Uh, that's obvious. Uh, yeah, Altis. Uh, in terms of the consistency cards, I know some people aren't playing these, but they're crazy. Uh, these are uh, probably boost up your win rate by a lot. Uh, we have three openings. This card is insane. Uh, then we have the one of so we got one lost, one brown and red. We're playing. I'm playing one brown and red because I'm playing the expulsion in the main deck. Uh, so before I was running two brown and red, uh, but uh, I think this is better. How did you and find the expulsion in the main? Uh, it, good? it won me so many games. I actually won me a game where um, I uh, expulsioned my uh, Quartus, uh, summoned his Fenrir, gave him something else, attacked with Fenrir, banished his thing, and then attacked for game. So it's not just the gimmick puppet lock. Uh, we have three Brand Infusion, uh, the uh, second best card in the deck. Uh, I think I won every game uh, I had this. And then we have the the spice. The spice. I, I, I already saw the sauce, but I want you to show off the sauce. I'm, I'm okay. excited for this. So this card carried me all day long. That the three Nadir wild. servant and the one branded in high spirit. So if you get ashed, as long as you have this, you are still making mirror jade on your opponent's turn. You could also do chimera, but I, I don't think that's correct. Uh, mm -hmm. But yeah, we could potentially go into the combos after. You gonna give a shout out to the. Yeah, yeah, we did. Uh, <laughs> uh, come yeah. on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> and then, and then uh, best card in the deck. This card won in me the so game. many oh, games. Baby. Literally, yeah. I think I... I don't know if I ever cited it out. It's like literally insane. Right, yeah, right. so the deck ha doesn't have a lot of room for non-engine. So these these are the, this is the non-engine we're playing. Uh, three Super Poly and three Ash. Uh, Ash is really good in most matchups. Uh, awesome in the main, decent in Cash Tira. Uh, and then this is just crazy. It's live against everyone. How many times have you Super Poly today? Uh, 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 too many times. <laughs> too many. It's, well, it's <laughs> always live. And then we have the uh, Bistil package, which, uh, it's okay. Um, this card's crazy. This one me against Ibley, uh, so that's why. Awesome. Then we have one ad lib 
uh, tragedy. Uh, you side this out sometimes, actually quite frequently, uh, but uh, the one tragedy is crazy. I'm only running one Mercurier. Some people are running two, but I feel like that's just kind of, you're just coping. Yeah, I, I do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then we have one Tri-Brigade kit. This is also part of the package for this, but it's also just crazy. Um, additionally, then we have one Dragoon. Uh, allows you to go into uh, sorry, one dark magician. Allows you to go bro, this is this is what I thought. It's not even dark magician. It's not even a it's card, bro. It's just called. It's just a good. good. It's just a good. good. This is this is like yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, there you go. And then we have the Cartesia. <laughs> Cartesia is crazy. Um, honestly, a lot of people don't know that you don't have to fuse this when you activate the effect. I had some people. I think in my second last match, where the guy um, he used these sprites. Um, the banish card, and he like banished us off, and I like still like play through him, and he just skipped. Well, smashers. Uh, smashers. Yeah, yeah, smashers. He, he, like, pe people don't know what it means. Uh, <laughs> then we have this card. I think specifically on YGO Pro, or is it uh, YGO Pro Scope or something? We get the win rates. I think this is the highest winning card in the deck. Um, it's at like fifty nine percent when you play it. Um, yeah. And then we have the Gimmick Puppets Expulsion oh, no. Combo with a Retribution in the main. Honestly, when I was running this in the side, it doesn't really come up. Like, realistically, I was like 2 owing everyone. Um, but if Dude, you the bro, like, that, co <laughs> that confidence is great. Yeah. It's like, oh, I never came up. I just 2 owed everyone. Yeah. Well, when you put it in the main deck, oh, you win so many free games off of this. It's like, it's That's actually nice. just insane. Yeah. Bad, so, dude. um, yeah, there we go. Bam. 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 I'm a Brandon player. I say bam yeah. that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the, the, it, it should get banned. Okay. The then we have uh, the side deck. Uh, I have, these are my going first cards. They don't really come up too often. Uh, we have called by uh, in like matchups where, yeah, when you're going first, I think I sided in this once. Um, I don't think I ever resolved it. No, I didn't. And then I have these two. This is really good going first against Sprite or Cash Tira. Um, it just, but yeah. How many yeah. times did you sign in a lot today? Uh, no, because honestly, like, I... He was just winning his game so fast, I, I, I you know? Two old, two, two old everyone. Two old everyone. Yeah. <laughs> uh, probably the cards I sided in most were these three evenly and dark ruler right when you're going second you need so strong going second cards to break through the board and then when you like you when you're running like three dark ruler three evenly three super poly three ash it's like super easy just to break anything and then we have the uh bestials this is came up i play against drytron math mech uh Branded. Wait, and which Dragon player? Uh, this guy. Mr. Mr. Yeah, Mr. I think, uh, Fifty. Bistrols need to get banned. Bistrols are bad. <laughs> yeah. So they are extremely strong in those matchups. Uh, you know. And then we have the Cosmics. I don't even think I. I don't even think I sided these in. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. Play I, I played one Runic. And oh, but uh, I, I'm sure <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, it was it was the for hire one. He was a good guy. He was a good guy. Uh, early in the tournament. Okay, and then we have uh, two Albion, uh, two Mirror Jade, two Lubellion. Uh, I think the most th the largest thing to think about is whether you run this at two or one. Um, I think two is is good. I think you have to because like if you're running it at one and they like lock zone zone lock you three, you don't really have any good options anymore. Uh, but it would be nice to run, be able to run the like some other fusion cards, and then for the one ups we have Mud Dragon. Mud Dragon's crazy. Like you can like there's a play where you go Lubellion, make Mud Dragon. Normal summon fall like they make this dark. Normal summon fall Valbaz, and then they can't do anything, and you just fuse. Uh, then you have this, the Albion. Albion. Uh, he's mainly there specifically to summon fall Valbaz on your opponent's turn. Dragoon, awesome. Uh, Chimera, probably one of the best cards in the deck. Just pop so much stuff and draw. Then we have the uh, Dusk Dragon, gets you a gimmick puppet in the graveyard, sets you up for next turn. We have the Guerrero Super Poly Target. You can also send it off the Dusk Dragon. And then we have the uh, Predator Plant. You can make this specifically with uh, Super Poly and Cartesia, it came up a lot of the times. Um, and then we have uh, this guy, awesome. And then we have the uh, sprint. Ooh. Is this what you're sending off so the deers? Yeah. Card. So the sprint <laughs> honestly came up. Like I think I like hard summoned this like three times, surprisingly. But it's also for the 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 combo. And then the, know about the special effect too, right? The move yeah. zone. Yeah. So so basically, uh, you can. Uh, it's also a super poly target, so mm -hmm. it requires Fall of Abbas plus some uh, few, uh, an effect monster that was special summon this turn. And so you can like literally super poly anything, and it has an effect where you activate it, and then it moves zones and kills everything in that column. 
right on your opponent. So it's pretty good. And then you, uh, it has a graveyard. Here, this little piece of yeah, you know, haunted with that card. Bro. Yeah, and then we have a graveyard effect. Uh, it can summon your full of Albaz um, during the end phase or special summon in the kit. Okay, so with that, maybe we can show the spice in action. So, specifically, this Nadir tech is designed to help you win when you get ashed. Um, it, like, if you just hold it in hand, and let's say uh, we Let's say we um, get ashed, right? Let's say I brand, we have brand fusion on the table. Mm -hmm. It gets ashed. Mm -hmm. What you do is you activate the dear servant, you send the, um, the sprint to the graveyard, you add your fallen Valbes to hand, right? Mm -hmm. And then during end phase, you activate this, um, and then you will special summon your uh, Springin's kit, and then kit effect activates, it'll add you any branded spell trap, and so what you're gonna do is you're gonna add your Brand High Spirit to hand. And because it's during the end phase and a quick effect, you will then activate it and you will discard, oh sorry, you will reveal the Fallen of Albaz. And because it's a dragon, you can then send this card to grave. And then after you do that, you can, it's optional. Uh, typically you will, actually, no, no, okay. So you, you will, it's optional, but you discard the Fallen of Albaz and then you can add any card that mentions Fallen of Albaz. You could add Cartesia, Mercurier, uh, Albion. Typically, you're gonna want to add the Mercurier to hand. And then uh, Albion effect will activate, setting brand in red. Uh, you can't activate it because the Deer Servant makes it so you can't special summon from the extra deck that turn. And then during your opponent's draw phase, uh, I'll activate brand in red, target full of Albaz. And then you use these two, you banish them, make the Rebellion, you discard a card, and then you make a Mirror Jade, and then you're just kind of chilling. So it makes it so that you can combo through Ash, essentially. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you'll have the Mercury Negate. Yeah, you have, yeah, you'll have a Mirror Jade, Live Mirror Jade, Mercury Negate, and they've already Ashed you, and now they're sad. So, uh, it's pretty there you crazy, go. I'm not gonna lie, because when I first saw you playing it, I was like, how does this synergize with this? Because I know it like locks you out and stuff. But like now it makes sense seeing it. I think a lot of people would like that stuff. Awesome. Well, you guys have uh, any other questions? Or? <laughs> no, that was cool. I don't know if you do. You have anything? I don't think so either. Uh, I just want to say congratulations, man. Yeah, um, I'm happy for you. Your first top, right? Right. Your first, first top. It's a win. Yeah. No, I'm uh, proud of it. Crazy. That's that's sick. Like it's nice when one of the guys talks, you know, especially when he wins and it's two O's everyone. Uh, <laughs> uh, before we end, probably shout out my fiance for all her support and uh, oh. I rate that. I rate that. That's cute. That's cute. Awesome. Awesome. So thank you for having me and yes, sir. Yeah. congratulations again. Um, I, yeah, I gotta do more deck profiles. So, uh, <laughs> we'll get there now. Congratulations, bro. Thank you, thank you. All right, take care.